Okay. Oh. Oh. All right, here we go. Ooh. Uh oh. Look at this. Holy crap. And the hits to the core keep coming. Are we about to see it? Oh. Alright. One, two. Oh. <laughs> Hello everyone. Welcome to another exciting episode of WWE 2K24. My rise on Disputed with Kid Gorgeous. King Kid Gorgeous. This episode we are going to be talking to Troy and finishing off the last story of the second chapter. Um, we're kind of curious to see what's going on. I think I have an idea, um, but we're going to get to it. Kid, King Kid Gorgeous has um, been ruling it. He's been dominating. He's, he's the man, so let's see what comes next. Troy, so good to see you, man. You too, champ. Your big victory solidifying your status as the only champion on SmackDown has Miz in the most cheerful mood. Believe me, the whole team is delighted with you. Sarcasm for sarcasm. I dig it. What do you and our must-see general manager have for me now? A live interview on The Bump that you're already running late for. And believe me, you don't want to miss this. Oh, I won't. I've never been more eager to tell the WWE Universe all about the Miz's stellar leadership. Great! There's a car waiting outside. It's not a limo or an SUV. It's actually a compact rental car that you'll be driving yourself. And you owe us $74.38. And it will actually be more than that if you don't fill up the gas before you return it. Wow. You guys really know how to treat your champions. Thanks, Troy. You're trash, Troy. Some say the story was finally completed on night two of WrestleMania when Cody Rhodes won the World Heavyweight Championship at last. But it felt like a beginning to me, Kayla. I agree, Byron. But our guest at this time is also in the midst of an incredible story. Please welcome the man who won the main event on night one, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Welcome, champ. Huge night for you at WrestleMania. Thanks, Byron. First, congratulations to Cody. He's been in the hunt for a long time. From one champ to another, here's to you. As Cody begins his championship journey, yours is becoming a marathon. I remember right after you won the WWE Universal title, Roman Reigns joked that you wouldn't last a month. Now it is day 666, and ooh, uh, hope that's not bad luck for your upcoming match. Wait, do you know something I don't? What match? Uh, yes, it wasn't meant to come out that way, but we do have some significant news to share on that front. Way to blow our big reveal, Byron. <laughs> anyway, Miz gave us the exclusive on your next championship defense. Well, I'm here. Might as well say it. Before I do, just remember we're only the messengers. This is straight from the Miz. You will defend the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against five other superstars in an Elimination Chamber match. I think Miz's words were actually, I'll put the toughest opponents from his past inside a cage and see if he's lucky enough to survive. Ha, 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 ha. So, uh, thoughts? I'm not phased. Sure, this will be one of the greatest tests of my reign in the Elimination Chamber. And Miz can bring out all the heavy hitters he wants. But I'm not going to need luck. Luck isn't going to enter the picture. They used to call me the Dark Horse. But now the WWE Universe knows that I am a workhorse. I'm going to out-hustle every man in the chamber, and I'm going to walk out still the undisputed WWE Universal Champion because Miz sets him up, and I knock him down. So, anything else you want to cover? Uh, I 
think you made your point. All right. <clears throat> Tonight, WWE Universal Champion King Gorgeous faces his greatest challenge yet as he defends his title in the Elimination Chamber against Drew McIntyre, Logan Paul, Kevin Owens, Rollins, and Kane. Wow. The Ring General will have a close eye on this match and will defeat whoever walks away champion. Haha! <laughs> Enjoy these final moments before you kiss your title goodbye, Kid Gorgeous, says the Miz. Alright. Yeah. Alright, guys. You think you got this? You think you're going to come up against the Great One? The Gorgeous One? And come out on top, prepare yourselves for the greatest whoop down you've ever seen. What does Balloon Marino has to say? Look at the smile. You look entirely too happy to be a general manager. I finally got the champion I should have had for quite some time. Cody? Good for him. Good for the business. He's an amazing talent carrying quite the legacy. I'm proud of him. He did win at, your, at, um, at WrestleMania, so he is champion in reality. I get your relief. The World Heavyweight title gets passed around so much over on Raw that it must have been hard to keep track. Hopefully Cody can hang on to it for a while. Except Cody's, of course, the um, undisputed WWE champion, not the World Heavyweight champion. But Seth Rollins is no longer champion, so... Hopefully you can hold on to the WWE Universal Championship through the Elimination Chamber tonight. Miz has assembled quite the rogues gallery. Yeah, consisting mostly of guys I already beat. And a plan to beat again. Overconfidence can blind one to unseen threats. I'm coming up on two years as WWE Universal Champion Regal. I think I've earned a little confidence at this point. Well, how you've changed. It would be interesting. What? If you get through the elimination chamber, perhaps Miz and I should start a conversation about the match everyone expected on your first night as champion. You versus Cody Rhodes. The match everyone expected me to lose? Bring it on. Wonder who the odds would favor this time. A fine question indeed. One that's been hanging over my head for a long time. I'm thinking maybe you're right. It's time we answered it. That's right. Maybe. But we'll talk more later. If you can survive tonight. Good luck. I'm not just going to survive, I'm going to thrive. All right, there I go, looking all regal. <laughs> Ah, uh, yes, from one king to another. Um, alright. I'm ready. My, uh, my thing is blowing in the wind. I've got the crown. I've got my, my, uh, my breastplate. Ready to do this. Let's go to the match. The champion is ready to break free and unleash chaos. The champion, everybody. The one who... And introducing the champion mm -hmm. from Richmond, Virginia. Weighing in at 228 pounds. He is the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, King Kid Gorgeous. <laughs> Look at the champ strutting toward the ring like a conquering hero, admiring trophies from his past battles. Well, I'm pretty sure his opponents remember those battles too, and let's just say they're not lining up to exchange pleasantries. They got the side plates. Oh my gosh. Five top challengers are all vying for the WWE Universal Championship. And not just any challengers, mind you, some of them 
have revenge on their mind. And you said it, Cole. Beating a man once takes skill. Beating a man twice takes guts. Beating them in an elimination chamber takes... Well, I just don't know if the champ has what it takes. Well, I'm eager to see what the champ is made of tonight in this daunting title defense. Fisherman's Buster! Big elbow! A calculated attack here against Logan. This is Logan Paul's perseverance getting tested. Ooh, slam! With authority. The challenger is looking shaken. Falls Count Anywhere one. matches are uniquely Ooh. demanding. He should know that. Double chicken wing, tiger Ooh. suplex. Right on the back of the neck. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Up and down, what a slam. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. I'm kind of curious who it's going to be. And right now, Kane's next to set foot in this eliminate. Perched up top, could be looking for a superplex. Maybe something Let's get this. More. This is going to be big. It's going to hurt. Oh, oh. And he goes for the pin. Go for the pin. Let's get to see. Why? Oh, my. How in the world did he kick out of that? Not getting a two count at this point has to be frustrating. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. Hits him with the counter. Oh, All right. God. And Kane is like watching, and I'm just like, uh, <laughs> oh, oh my goodness, what? From the ground. Uh oh, oh dang it. I missed that why so terribly. Dang it. Uh, I should have just let Kane hit him. This is insulting. This is entertaining. Just no respect for the champ shown there. Dang. Makes the cover. And now Rollins. And easily kicks out of the count. Gonna take a lot more than that to keep this man down. Big overhand. Thank you. Why, does I, why, did, I even, why did I even look at Logan Paul? Assuming I was just fighting. He scores a reversal on Rollins. Uh -oh. Crap. Dang it. Wait a second. Why well, do I have all those penalties on me? Uh oh, watch out! Double Russian leg sweep! A brief instance of teamwork here, but how long is it going to last? Great strength being shown here. Oh, just bounced that face like a basketball. Oh, it's kicking it. Ready to dive into the elimination chamber. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Come on, don't be looking at me. And more attacks up there could leave him stunned. Each blow affecting his equal. There we go. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. What? We're going to free the arm and does just that. One. He breaks the rest. Ah, I had that. I had it. Take it, Kate. No. Stop! Why did I look? Why did I turn? Why did I turn around? I didn't. I didn't. I don't understand why I turned around. I. There's no reason for me to turn around. He had just hit me. Drew McIntyre has been unleashed in the chamber. There we go. All right. Crap. Nope. He saw that one coming. Back and forth from these competitors. Okay. DDT. Is it enough? The cover. Kicking out now sends a very clear message. Off the turnbuckles. What's he going to do? His set was able to be tamed there. Oh, this is not good for me. I've already taken out a lot of damage. And... Uh-oh, I 
think Rollins might have got cut there. Again, I don't understand why it changed what I was looking at. I was just that fighting Rollins. And all of a sudden, it decides, hey, you know what I'm going to do? Take it. Why are they stumped? Unnecessary. He's standing up. There we go. Crap. Left by the turnbuckles. Dang it, I missed my uh my Y. Ah, uh, come on, come on, come on. Rollins has a hook. Oh man. Getting into the cover. Oh. Oh, I thought the champ had it. Almost uh -oh. inhuman at this point. Crap. Can't prepare your face for that. How's that for a counter? Dang it, every freaking everywhere I go. No, oh, I'm stunned. Come on. Come on. Come on. We're going to free the arm and does just that. A big red monster. Uh oh. Counters with an elbow right into the face. Ooh. This is it. Meanwhile, here's Drew McIntyre. Still in it with a quick kick out. I can't believe the ref didn't even get to one. Drop kick. I should have got that on uh, a Logan Paul. I was there to get that on Paul. Why do I do that? Why would... Oh. He shouldn't have jumped like that. Oh. Ouch. This is so random. That was... Alright. I'm going to try to not lose my cool. I'm going to try not to lose my cool. There we go. One, two. Oh, he's just resilient. No, 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 no. Don't, don't get the top rope. Ooh, there we go. Come on. Oh, I lost. One. Oh. It was twice now. Twice now I could have won. But we need more than one ref in here. We need more than one ref. I was, I've lost I was two times now. Big reversal. Ah. Uh. He had it scouted. Don't think it. Thank you, Owens. Thank you, Owens. Ah. Uh. Come on. We got this. We got this. Just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Back into the hip toss. The challenger not looking good right now. I was pumped when I saw this match on tonight's card, but so far this falls count anywhere match has exceeded all of my expectations. Been kicked right to the gut. And there's Rollins delivering yet another devastating attack. This right here is a testament to the sheer willpower of Seth Rollins. Suplex. Crap. Evades their offense. Thank you. I actually. Thank you. Uh, come on. Everyone hits me. Uh, come on. There we go. There we go. I got the pass on hit. Thank you. Okay, don't look at me. Don't look at me. Hey, look at somebody else. Look at anybody else. Anybody else. Anybody else, Kane. Anybody else. Anybody else. Anybody else. He thinks he has it. No, stops the count. Crap. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. Okay. You know what? I'll see you. I'll see you out of here. Time for me to recover. Because my body is hurting. Right into the oh. This elimination 
Elimination Chamber match is now down Don't to the for entrance. Me. Come on. On the outside now, one of the most dangerous places to be in the Elimination Chamber. Cover! And the count stops short of two. Somehow All right. still has the energy for a quick kick out. Set up for a second time. Sleeper slam! Now that is why they're the champ. Cover! One, two, three. One of these superstars will win this Elimination Chamber match. Kane needs to get his wits about him fast. Future Shock DDT! Future Shock, good night. The champ's eyes look glazed over. And it comes down to this. The last two competitors. Who will make this chamber their battleground? Uh-oh. Unsure what they're thinking. Oof, me versus Drew at the end. The champ in a worst case scenario. Not what you want to see by any means. All right. A modified clover leaf applied. Boom. Oh, into a backbreaker. Painful. Drew suddenly backed into a wall now. Yeah, McIntyre's finding himself in grave circumstances right now. Oh, okay. Right. Oh. Oh. Like All right, ball. here we go. Ooh. Uh oh. Look at this. Holy crap. And the hits to the core keep coming. Are we about to see it? Oh. All right. One, two. Oh. Oh. Now might be a good Here we go. Rethink. Ta-da. Two. 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 One, two, three. And the <laughs> that was tough. Oh, wow. And still. The WWE Universal Champion has outlasted the toughest opponents from his past. But now, what lies ahead? He's pretty much defeated everyone. What lies ahead is the champion who has reigned longer than the Dark Horse, and that's Gunther. It's time we see those two. Oh. Look at sweaty old beautiful me. Oh, look at that face. Look at that belt. Look at those side plates. The gorgeous one. Reigns supreme. I just survived the toughest opponents from my past in the Elimination Chamber. So now what? Do I take some time off? Maybe hit the golf course? Rest up and recover? Nah. I don't think so. See, there's one other superstar in WWE who's actually been champion longer than I have. And I've been hearing rumblings for a long time that he deserves what I have that somehow he's more worthy than me. I'm talking about you, Gunther. I'm ready to quiet all the doubters once again. You think you deserve what I have? Then come and try to take it. Whew, there we go. One in the chamber. That was one indeed. That was, uh... That was the first one there. So we got, now we got the side quests here again. So we got Ava Marino, who, well, I mean, she's a nice looking woman there. Um, even though she was into that breathing app cult thing going on over at the lady's side. But, and of course, she's also the friend of uh, Tessa, the Terror Tornado. But things happen, you know, things, things can happen. Um, nice things can happen. Anyway, Kaiser says, Kid Gorgeous should keep Herr Gunther's name out of his mouth, lest he draw a greater man's attention. It's, I mean, it's, it's, it's nice of you to you know, cuddle and cuddle and, anyway, 
Grime says, as locker room leader, just thought you'd want a heads up. Gunther and Imperium are the least of your problems. All right, so that's interesting. Uh, what other problems are there? What problems could be the least? Um, I mean, uh, what, what problems are, are bigger and better and greater than Gunther and Imperium? Uh, I'm curious. Um, let's see, also, I'm kind of curious while well, uh, bumping up my attributes here. And so I can right now, I can bump up my striking. I will do that. It's been, it's been enough. It's been a long time. It's been enough, long enough time for me to do that. Or do I wait and then bump up my grappling? I do, I think I'll do that, actually. Because I'm a technical wrestler. So my submission and my grappling have to be at the top. So I'll do that. And so I'll talk to Grimes. But do I want to talk to Grimes first? Or do I want to talk to uh, Geneva Rose or Ava first? I'll talk to Ava because it's a, it's a challenge match. And challenge is like a, a one-time little thing there. And then I'll um, end the episode at that. Have to talk to Ava. And hey, I know you've been dominating. But looks like you might have an even bigger test coming with Gunther and Imperium. Probably makes sense to get ready for anything. And since there isn't a ton of time, you might as well get ready for everything all at once. How about an extreme rules match against Tommaso Ciampa? It's the perfect way to prepare for that tough battle ahead, you know? I agree with you, Ava. Indeed. I agree with you. Yeah, are you gonna come to the ring with me? There's nothing better than extreme rules where unbridled madness and mayhem reign supreme. There's always a lot of anticipation for a match like this, Ooh. and as always, Ooh, with nice. extreme that was rules, a nice we part. should expect the unexpected. That seems to be the theme around here. He switches it back around. What? How do I miss that? Punch. <laughs> do, uh, Absolutely oh. oh, wow. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Ah. Setting them up for Ooh. the Fisherman's Buster. And it's Champa having to endure some bad intentions there. Yeah, but he expected extreme pain in an Extreme Rules match. Crank in the head. And he sends him into the corner. Waistlock applied in the corner. Check out this power. Overhead, belly to belly. Tommaso Ciampa needs to figure out a solution. Ciampa needs to rely on his intensity here. Got him where he wants him. Up and back arrow. Yes. Double chicken wing, tiger suplex. Uh-huh. You saw the original. How about the director's cut? Climbing to the top rope. High risk. Right up to their feet with an elbow drop. Oof. He is efficient and dangerous with his offense thus far. He's mixing precision and physicality with his attacks here. Big time move coming up. The black Oof. card with a counter. Using the elbow to escape the attack. What? Counters. What? How do I how do I keep missing this? How do I miss the close lines? That is two close lines I've missed now. Are you joking right now? In a kick out. Are you joking? Toss and knee right to the jaw. Good night. Taking this no. Oof. That was ridiculous. Toss caution out the window, and it paid off. Adrenaline is through the roof now. Get the table. Look at the velocity into the table. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. What a wrist clutch suplex. He's 
one step ahead there. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Double under Through the, the table. Oh, my Lord. Through the table. That table exploded. <laughs> I don't think we should be worried about the table, Saxon. There's a human being under the record. I risk. Through the oh, 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 oh. Just crashing oh. down with There we go. Champa is in some serious trouble, but Champa will do anything to get back in this. Oh, God. Right in the chest. Oh, my. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. Okay, get in there. What? Get inside the ring, you knucklehead. What do you think this is? Brought back into the ring from the floor now. You have to wonder how much more can Champa take? This could be his. My friends, we have reached. Oh! Tommaso Champa hit hard. That's gonna oh. be it. Two. And that's all she wrote. <laughs> for the WWE Universal Champion. Every time you think this guy's down, he finds a way to pull victory from the jaws of defeat. No one likes to lose, but Champa downright abhors it. He's even more dangerous when he loses. <laughs> Excellent. So now we've got that down. And another challenge match. Do I have time for it? Do I have time for it? That was kind of a wash. That was kind of a um, that was kind of a uh, a squash. So I think I'm gonna do one more, one more challenge challenge match. And it was great a reunion. Kid Gorgeous and Tavish together again. Friends, friends together again. You're my best friend. Ooh, you make me live. All right, let's talk to Tavish. One more match. Listen, champ, I've been thinking. The ring can turn into a right old brawl. Bodies flying and bones cracking. But there's a glimmer of beauty in that chaos. Now, what if we could take all that pain and fury and put it to good use, eh? A charity submission match where the art of the tap-out meets the heart of raising a few quid for those in need. What you say? Uh, yeah. 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 Um. I've, I can do this. We're going up against Cole, though. BCW. What? I'm going up against Tavish? Aw, oh, Tav. Tavi. Tav, man. I like to believe I'm about to whoop Tavish down. <laughs> this is how you blew their entire uh, budget on fireworks for an entrance. But I mean, also, I mean, they got the, the, the WWE Undisputed Champion here, so why not break out the fireworks? King Kid Gorgeous, ladies and gentlemen. King Kid Gorgeous. Yeah. I'm just glad they got the side plates going. I am so thank you for that. Thank you guys. It must have heard me complaining about it. Because they weren't there, but now they're there and I love it. I really appreciate it. Alright. Let's 
says attempt to beat him by submission. Ooh. Again, some having it. And some more head twisted. I like pain doing this. Like, get up. Yeah. Tavish, did you really know what you were getting yourself into? And okay, cap. That was one button. That was a B instead of an A. Ah, oh, cap. I missed that Y. I was. I knew it was coming too. What? Come on. Oh, that looks painful. Ooh. Boom. 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 There we go. It's a little bit better. And... This is going to be a fight. I realize this now. Crap, I got a little spear going on me. Dang, I'm, I totally missed the. Uh... Crap, here versus the uh, fifth submission we were tried. Oof. Wow, Falcon Zero. I love it. I love that move. Get you in here. Boom. Ooh. Go. What? He reversed it. He reversed it. He reversed my finisher! No! Dang it, he reversed my finish by my, my submission. Ooh, that hurts. That hurts, Tavish. That hurts. Tavish has like barely any kind of life. He is. I, uh, I'm actually kind of a, a surprise that he's actually, uh,
Boo. Tavish, you really shouldn't even be in this ring anymore. I'm going to get you inside the ring. All right. I totally hit the wrong thing. I meant to um, do this. And... Oh, he did the, uh... All right. He reversed the submission. Are you joking right now? What? No, 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 no. All right. Submission. That was a that was a hardy fight. That was a fight. He put he put me uh well actually well I for the most part dominated most of the match. But he uh, he kept getting some good reversals in. I must say I was impressed by Tavish's uh persistence, his perseverance, his survival in that match. Uh again, submission matches are really tough. Um Alright, so I got his my faction card. Um, I don't really you, you do that whole my faction thing, but it's nevertheless. Um, yeah. So I'll talk to Tavish and say, says, brilliant performance. That charity match was a right blast. The way we raised those funds, even though it came at my physical expense, warms his old heart. Hope you can carry that momentum forward against Gunther. Got that right, I will. All right, that's this episode. Next episode, I'm going to go up. Hold on a second. got to talk to Ava. Il Marino says, that was an inspiring victory. It's one thing to say you've got to be ready to push yourself to the extreme. It's another to actually do it. Amazing. I am amazing. Yes, that is true. Um, so, yep. So, next episode, we are going to go up against... Um, well, I'm assuming that we're going up against Grimes, but who knows what's going on. Who knows what he's going to say. Uh, that's going to be a story there, and uh, we're going to go with Grimes, and then we're going to talk to Geneva Rose. I might just talk to I might talk to Geneva, Geneva Rose first, uh, and then after that I'll talk to Grimes. Then after that it will probably lead into Troy. Um, you know, talking to him about the Gun Gunther match. Um, there may be another side m match here, story progression, Age of Imperium. So let's say going, going Gunther. I already took care of these two. Okay, so this is actually a very short chapter. There's only five to complete. So I'm going to take care of these two. Then uh, talk to fight off, fight Gunther. Um, and so this is going to be a nice chunk of uh, points I'm going to get. I got 10 from this, 10 from this one. Then I'm going to do, uh, like, I guess, the uh, Geneva contention. I guess talk to Geneva. Um, who knows? That's going to be 20 points. So who knows? Who knows? probably going to have like three matches for that. Uh, then we're going to have 16 points with this. So that's going to be 36. So, and then I'm going to go do this. This is going to be 25. So it's going to be a lot. It sounds like I've got a lot of matches based on those just attribute points alone. But until next time, like, share, subscribe, comment. Uh, hit that like button. Hit that like button. Treat that like button like it's your lifeline and you need it to survive. Um, but again, again, share. 
like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Until next time.